Hi everyone. I wanted to show some of the evidence about this incident that happened a while back in 2014 where the Siri for the iPhone when you asked it a question what is July 27th that the phone the Siri app actually said the gates of hell will open on July 27th 2014 the iPhone does not say this anymore. When you ask it what is July 27th, it just says that that is that day. It doesn't say that it is the gates of Hades opening in any way. But some people made some videos showing this. This man right here, December 18th, 2013. So let's listen to this here from InfoWars. What is July 27th, 2014? It's Sunday, July 27th, 2014, opening gates of Hades. Opening gates of Hades. So you can see that that's what it says right there. July 27th would be the opening gates of Hades. Now I said, like I was saying, this has been changed now. Well, let's do some research here. On my channel, for the last couple of years, we have been mapping out the end of days all around us showing how the Lord God is giving us messages all day long. First thing to know is, what is Siri? Siri represents the dog star Sirius. The dog star Sirius is considered to be the star of Bethlehem. The same one that the three wise men followed and it led them to Jesus Christ. It led them to the Messiah. So right here we do have a connection with this. See? Sirius. And we have Siri telling us this. Well, in the investigations that we have done on our channel, Sirius, the dog star, has a lot to do with what's going on. Here is one of many glyphs we have broken down from all around the world. I have broken down hieroglyphs from every culture all around the world. And the people have just not been telling us the truth. Nearly all of them show the end of days and map out Jesus Christ as the Lord and Savior. Even here in Egypt on this Akhenaten glyph, Moses was brought out from underneath the burdens of Egypt and set free. Even the Exodus was all showing God's glory. That will happen again. We are still underneath this burden now. Egypt can be, could be considered to be our taxes or the Roman Catholic Church now. But over here you can see this individual coming down through a stargate and he goes into this sphinx which represents Obama. And this whole glyph maps out the Bible end times perfectly. The great deception coming with this new seed, this nuclear event that goes off by these two domes. Up here is Siri. There is the dog star Sirius, considered to be the star of Bethlehem, part of God's throne. Anything underneath this dog is having the burdens of Egypt, all of us. We have to get above this. When you're above this, this is where Jesus Christ will sit. He will be on top of the throne. The left side is the accuser, Satan, who accuses us all day and night like a prosecuting attorney. On the right side is where Jesus Christ sits, the power of God, and he's our defender. See this phoenix ready to leave in a rapture situation when this giant bomb goes? See right here? And then Russia will rise up for a time. But you can see him coming right there. There is the dog star Sirius. That is Siri, the star of Bethlehem. All right there in front of us. And it says the gates of Hades will be open. Okay, we've shown that as a detectives. We have seen how this can be viable. And the solar systems are actually controlling everything. A human being is known as a host for spirits. You either have the Holy Ghost with you. Or something else could be using you at any point in time. Now, let's go to the next section here. What is July 27th? Well, it's seven days after the moon launch and moon landing of Apollo 11, where Buzz Aldrin and them made their first footprints on the moon, seven days after July 20th, which has an awful lot of things to do also with the fall of Jerusalem in 70 AD, as <clears throat> Jesus predicted. Jesus predicted in Matthew 24 that all of the that the temple would fall. And a lot of people seem to think that that's going to be another temple. 
when in reality right here in 70 AD the siege of Jerusalem Titus came and all of Jerusalem fell and every single rock and stone was torn down from the temple even the Christians at that time that remembered Jesus prophecy actually fled to the mountains and the Christians were saved while over a million Jews were killed and butchered by the Romans in 70 AD on July 20th seven days before July 27th well I have not found anything really substantive about July 27th but they did do something here recently remember we showed about that Phoenix leaving see the Phoenix leaves when the gates of Hades are open let's do this real quick I'm sorry maybe I didn't show people this the gates of Hades being open is in Revelation 9 and it represents when the bottomless pit is open see and the fifth angel sounded and I saw a star fall from heaven unto the earth and to him was given the key of the bottomless pit I saw a star fall from heaven and to him was given the key of the bottomless pit see it being opened there's Siri there's the angel there's the key to the bottomless pit all right in front of us now we showed on July 20th that we had the siege of Jerusalem and also when the moon landing happened because the moon landing symbolizes a rapture event in all of these in all of the things that we have shown it's like we have to go from here through the moon then through the star systems to get our soul out of here it's, it's a real process going on the whole solar system is part of God's big machine but on July 27th they made sure to put the Phoenix 2007 27 you see this 2007 makes a 27 also the Phoenix news helicopter it's talking of this collision here representing this big event and when the Phoenix could fly now does this mean this will happen on the 27th we don't know we will have to continue to find these things out and look and see well for many years we have been mapping out all of the world showing how the Lord God has set everything in place for us just like Siri is actually the dog star Sirius the star of Bethlehem and everybody's running around with it right in their hand and yet they don't know that's the other thing we show on my channel all the time is that how 99 percent of the world can be just going right along and think they know everything and only a small percentage percentage of people actually know that we're in a big matrix and that everything's going according to plan all we have to do is be able to let people know these things then they will wake up and see these as a possibility just like right here now that you know the possibility that every single thing on the earth has been made to show what's coming you can start to look and you can start to believe and start to see these things all around us you can look like right here see here in the USA perfectly all the way down to this foot in Louisiana in the Bible this is known as the little horn of the Bible coming right here and he's coming to do the guillotines America is known as the daughter of Babylon in the Bible mystery Babylon is Rome the Vatican and the USA is the military might of Rome that is what this both of these will fall and receive a grievous head wound in the Bible right here you can actually see that Oklahoma makes the axe every single thing is, is worked out perfectly like this all the way the I have all of this mapped out all of every country it all maps out what's coming now down here in Louisiana you can see in the Gulf right here you can see the Phoenix ready to fly there it is see the Phoenix see the foot all ready to go see how Louisiana is exactly like a trigger just like when they had the oil the big oil rig explosion down here that represented the rapture coming this big event because we need oil to ascend is what it says in the Bible your faith and the Word of God are considered to be oil you see how this is here here is Siri and now you can see the two domes and the Phoenix flying see that's a magic wand this, there is magic involved you know I mean Jesus walked on water Jesus was raised from the dead Jesus turned water into wine it's real he is on this side he has all of this power 
This side is the accuser. He points at you and says you're a sinner. Down here is the domes, right over Havana. But you can see the dome right there. See how this is the dome? We can go on and on and on all through this. I mean, I have everything mapped out. We can go for hours and hours showing how everything links perfectly to Scripture. We're going to stop right here and go down here and show that I've been showing for years that you can actually see a number 21 right here. See this? There's domes off of there. See the 21? It's better when you look from farther away. But do you see right here the two breasts? The two domes? It even represents the birth. We are born through the chest this time of water and spirit. But you can see that a little bit better right there. See the, the, the breasts? And you can see 21. Now does that mean the 21st century? That could be. But either way, July is also known as the Ghost Month, is the legend, when a time of gates is opened between different things. So you can see right there, there is the eagle flying, and there in the Bible is what is called the little horn, who raises from the bottomless pit when the gates of hell are opened, all according to scripture. Let's see what happens. Let's keep faith in the Lord Jesus. Confess with your mouth, the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart, God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. The Phoenix. 2-7. Thank you very much, everybody. Hallelujah.